protective. Since the start of the pandemic, medical experts have said any mask is better than no mask. And that's still the case to an extent. With the Omicron variant spreading rapidly, one doctor here at UNM Hospital recommends wearing thicker and more tightly fitted mask masks for better protection. Dr. Megan Brett is an infectious disease doctor at UNM. She explains how face masks continue to help during the pandemic. Masks can be helpful two ways. They can help you not get an infection potentially, and they can also reduce the risk of transmitting infection to other people as well. As the CDC and many schools have recommended KN95 or N95 masks, we asked Dr. Brett, what is the difference? An N designates that they've been reviewed by OSHA here in the United States. The KN designation means that it was rated by China. She says a key component to how those masks work is their tight fit. Those can be more effective because they filter more particles and they also are tighter fitting. So I think they also help reduce the amount of particles that get in just because they fit a little bit more tightly. She says if people only have access to a surgical mask or cloth mask, the best thing to do is it's actually better to probably put a cloth mask over a surgical mask and how that helps is with fit. I think double surgical or double procedural masking is not the best solution. I actually think that a cloth mask that kind of holds the, the procedural mask against your face is better. When it comes to how many times you can reuse those surgical masks, Dr. Brett says you can use it over and over again unless it gets wet, dirty, or the metal part does not pinch on your nose properly. Reporting outside UNM Hospital, Stephanie Muniz, KOAT Action 7 News. The U.S. is expected to give away 400 million N95 masks at community centers and pharmacies in upcoming weeks.